grab yourself one of these right here. This is probably not the right way to do it, but I'm gonna do it like that. <laughs> it was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. No, baby, let's go. Damn, it's copyright. Oh shit. Tamo, fucking activo. Yo, we back. No, son. Yo, we back at it. You already know where we going. Should I even say the word? Bro, we back at it. Yeah, like man. and subscribe the video before we even do anything. That's a fact. Comment sure. below to continue deep. Damn, that shit got my ears ringing. My bad. Yo, vlogs are here. If you want them to stay, put it down below. Stay hydrated. So we out here uh, taking over Brooklyn by storm right now. Yes, Wait, sir. We're going to Devocion get some of the best coffee in uh, Brooklyn, so they claim. So they so claim, right? We're here to disprove or approve. Yeah, we'll, we'll let you know in a second. But it says here, taste the difference in a single sip, right? Okay. Word. You've been drinking month-old coffee. Okay, so that's why the Devocion team does everything short of picking the cherry and do it faster than anyone else. We hand select our 1,000 plus farm partners, drill dry mill at our um, Bogota, Bogota, Bogota. Wow, Bogota facility, control the export process, and roast in Brooklyn. So we're gonna see. Let's see, you know, babe. What is, where is that? Where is that? It is, um, yeah. It's more down there. Oh, I see it. All right, so, you know, we coffee connoisseurs out here, so this right here, this is gonna be a little test of flavor. But if mm -hmm. you guys like this video, let mm -hmm. us know and we'll go around all of Brooklyn and see what really is the best of the best coffees out here. Mm -hmm. you know what I'm so, yo, you see that right here? Look at this sign real quick. This is a bold claim right here, because you know, this is, this is a bold claim if I've ever seen one. The only fresh coffee in NYC. Really? Really? <laughs> I bet. Smell that already. Just this. Look, I got the beans right here, bro. I got the beans right here. Oh, shit. About a ton. You and we just walked in. Yo, bro, 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 bro. I see that heavy. Yeah. They be roasting right here or whatever they do. Do they really? I look right here. Check this out. Just tender. That's crazy. I'm gonna keep it up with you. It smells divine in here. That's a fact. Honestly, I really do smell the difference. I ain't even gonna lie. We'll put this order in there and show you what we got. And, uh, what does you? You can see that, babe. Look at this right here. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna do a little taste test. Taste <laughs> It's mad good, but you know what? I like things sweet. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna add one of these sugars in the roll, you know what I'm saying? Did you add any? Not yet, no. You know what? We got two, just because, you know, we live in life. We live in like Larry today. <laughs> there you go. I eat. you get one of these things right It's compostable. There you go. It don't even look like it, but it is. Boom. Mix it up, right? Grab yourself one of these right here. This is probably not the right way to do it, but I'm gonna do it like that. <laughs> We're not gonna say nothing. <laughs> Alright, so I'm not gonna lie. We've been here already. Yeah. But you know what? <laughs> we capped OD. We capped, but you know what? What's the fun Alright, so take two. You can see the coffee on the table. I'm also not gonna lie. We've already been here before. But. What's the fun in that if we already spoiled it? Yeah. This shit is already good. Right. We know that. Right. Yeah. This shit yeah. is amazing. You ain't put no sugar in that? No, I put like one sugar. Look at all that sugar down here. Yo, is this copyright? Probably. Oh my god. So, we tried to get some B roll in there. What I'll say is coffee? Out of ten. We're doing out of five or out of ten. Out of ten. Say for me. I got the latte by the way, ice latte with oat milk. Mm -hmm. Um, taste. I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give it a 7.5. I'm gonna give it a 7.5. Um, 
damn near eight. Environment, you know, wicked. Staff was staff was cool, but it was a little weird. Like we try to be, you know what? I'm not even gonna mention what. <laughs> Yo, but nonetheless, this shit. What you doing, Rachel? Man, me, right, I, have to sip, taste. I have to sip it again. Hold on, what's that? Word. Mira esta. Coñazo. Huele bicho. Tanto hijo de say that. I'd say, to be honest, I never got this one before. But you got, what'd you get? I got the nitro cold brew. You was about to get the draft, right? I was right? gonna get the draft because I've had the draft before. They recommended me the nitro cold brew. I'm gonna be honest. This tastes kind of like 7-Eleven nitro cold brew. I'll say it. I'll say it. But I will tell you that while I might not be getting this one again, what I usually get, which is what Anthony got, that shit is always slap. And that one, I would say, I would give it probably like an eight and a half to a nine, to be honest. Um, Cause I really like their, their lattes. This, this nitro, I feel like I could have gotten it at 7-Eleven. But well, you got almond milk, right? I got almond milk, but I, I usually <clears throat> use the almond milk when I get the nitro at 7-Eleven regardless, which isn't bad. Right. Don't get me wrong. The 7-Eleven nitro is not bad at all. Um, <laughs> it's just, Maybe I expected a little bit more of that kind of like espresso kind of Right, right, right. So how much how much it go for a subs? What like four bucks maybe? Two and a half. Damn. Yeah. And this shit was here? This shit was like five ninety five, I think. I think my shit was like six thirty something. Not to mention like they only have one size, which is like it's cool. I wish they had a l I would have got a bigger because I like mm -hmm. lattes and shit, but this is like But don't get me wrong. Well, this might not necessarily be what I expected when I came here. It's good, right? Um, and this is, this is not usually what I get when I come here. Um, I usually get what Anthony gets. And that, I can definitely tell you, is amazing. You can taste the difference. I mean, it leaves like very citrusy kind of fruity notes after, um, like in the aftertaste and stuff like mm -hmm. that. It's amazing. I love it, mm -hmm. you know? Um, but this is good. And, you know, it's always a good vibe when you come here. Yeah. So, I was, trying to, I was trying to ask homeboy some questions in there, right? I wanted to ask him shit like, oh, where's the beans? I wanted to get in depth with it, but he, didn't, he wasn't having it. So I was like, all right. I mean, not everybody wants to be on YouTube. Yeah, which is fine. If you in Williamsburg, I would say, if you got, if you're feeling like, whatever, if you're bored of your usual, give it a shot. Is it like, yeah. is it like a must go? Maybe for the scenery. Maybe that's what I was gonna say. If you come in here, you gotta get some work done. This is a cool vibe. You know what I'm yeah. saying? If you want to do some coffee in and out, you're not gonna chill. Then it's, you're not missing out. Well, yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's really good. Mm -hmm. And there is a difference. Good. But maybe not for an everyday cafe. Like you're not gonna be spending six dollars on something yeah. like this. Yeah. I mean, the the price to the size ratio really. Right, like yeah. for this yeah. price, I could have got Starbucks for like a grand, like a menti or whatever, a large. Yeah, but so, so. I, I'm never disappointed when I come here, and every time I come to Grand Street, um, whether I'm shopping at Supreme or whatever, because the store's down the block, I always come here. It's always a good time. The sad part is I'm about to down this in like a minute. Yeah, needless to say, I wish I would have gotten that, because that is my usual. Like I said, let us know in the comments if we should do an episode where we go around mm -hmm. and find the best coffee the in best. Brooklyn. In Brooklyn, if you guys want it, and if we could get what we get. Yeah, 25 to 50 likes. From 25 to 50 likes. All right, right. And then on that video, we get 100 likes with the Queens, mm -hmm. through Manhattan, mm -hmm. go up to the boroughs. Yeah, yo, Flushing has some wicked coffee spots where it's or, very different. Or if you guys it's want to try some other stuff. Flushing has some coffee spots that are very, very special. Yeah. Um, so definitely let us know if y'all want to see that. Um, I mean, we have spots in mind. Uh, just to name a few, like um, Say Coffee, yeah. um, Brooklyn Roasting Company, um, uh, what's it called? Starbucks Roastery, which actually looks really dope. Yeah. I've never been. Me neither. You know, I was passing through. Yeah. Uh -huh. so I've never actually been inside. So yeah. we better continue on. A little photo shoot. You might get some B-roll of that, we might not. If this is the end of the vlog, like the video, subscribe, watch our other videos, and watch our old vlogs because we stopped doing vlogs for a minute, but if you wanted to come back, just show us some, some love. That's all we need is some motivation. That's right.
saying? Make sure to join the Discord. Thanks. Much love. And go live every Tuesday and Thursday. That part. You know what I'm saying? So pull up quick post notifications on because every week, every Tuesday, 7:30 p.m. EST. Still.